okay, y'all, I'm back home and I'm ready to talk. So boom, he said it could be one of three things, and I remember two. The first thing is I was misdiagnosed, and he he requested all of my um tests since 2019, so for the past five years, um, because he said he cannot find an initial test where I was considered like HIV positive because all of my tests are indeterminate. Boom. Or the second thing is that I had it and my body stopped producing the antibodies for it, which means that my body kicked the virus out or something else. I, I, I wasn't really paying attention to that one. I'm not going to lie. But um, he got, he ordered a, a different set of tests. Basically, it's not, I don't know how to explain this shit, man. Y'all got me fucked up. But um, basically, the test is going to check to see if I ever, 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 ever had it. Not just these follow-up tests and then they prescribe me medicine for another year and I just go in for follow-ups. No, they're going to do the initial test. Like, they are going to unwrap unravel my blood i guess and like dissect it and see you know for the further testing so i think this one may take a little bit longer to come back but right now i don't it's not showing and he was like i was so excited to talk to you y'all that man stayed in there and talked for 45 minutes tiktok is not gonna let me upload no 45 minute video so i just i'm trying to break it down for y'all but let me put let me put the video up what he's talking about he also said the initial doctor who um did my blood work and just put me in okay because this is how it went y'all I went to the blood bank the blood bank he said the blood bank test so sensitive it could have been anything you know what i'm saying like because they give their blood out and because people put this blood in their bodies they just so sensitive and they automatically like hell no this what it is okay so boom when i went to the doctor that's what i went with they didn't do no other set of tests outside of what the fuck i don't know how to explain it but basically there is no initial test saying that i have a positive test what, what would make me hiv positive and he also said this y'all so if you got fucking tested in 2019 right before covid came out or when covid was going on go get retested yeah ask for one of them tests that go like that dig deep not just no fucking rapid test and none of that shit ask for a fucking test that's yeah because a lot of people were misdiagnosed from my understanding this is what the doctor is telling me a lot of people were misdiagnosed and it's not fair because y'all don't know what the fuck going on in the world you assume it's hiv y'all that man said i probably could have had covid like i had all the symptoms like if you really look at the symptoms of covid and hiv they the same i was fucked up i couldn't taste like y'all i was fucked up and this is at the end of 2019 before right before covid hit so yeah if you fucking got tested and you, you feel like you don't got this shit go back also if you're on big tarvey and you want a clean switch switch to dovato because it's pretty potent and that's what the other thing was he said it could be the dovato making the shit not show up in my system because of the the type of medicines they put in the man hey listen this shit so much to unravel so much to i'm excited to know that i buy the bitch right now i still can't use name because i probably ain't never had nothing it's crazy yeah deal mm -hmm. so there are across the world a few cases of people who are hiv positive who lose the antibodies mm -hmm. okay they're rare i have one in my practice currently and the important to this test is scouring through your records back in 2019 to see who made that diagnosis and how. So in the old days, 10 years ago, I, it, we had older tests, but they, people were pretty much either positive or negative, and we kind of went with that. As tests got fancier and fancier, um, we started seeing more false positives pop up with these newer generation tests. And that's because they can, I think in a way they can detect HIV earlier, but also be a little bit more prone for error. So the fourth generation test had a lot of people that were misdiagnosed as HIV positive, and that required a confirmation follow-up test. So, oh, really? so we're hoping that if the good news is did they misdiagnose you and mm -hmm. you're not HIV. So in the people who have lost their antibodies or don't make antibodies to HIV, which are a handful of patients, um, historically they've made decisions to stop their antiretroviral therapy. And when they do that, they notice the drop in their T cells pretty rapidly. Mm -hmm. So in that case, we said, you probably are one of these kind of people that are HIV positive who just don't make antibodies anymore for whatever reason. And we put them back on meds and their CD4s go back up, okay? If you have no HIV, really starting or stopping your antiretroviral shouldn't manipulate your T cell level at mm -hmm. all, okay? So it's a risk to go off your Devato and then to see what happens. There is a test called proviral DNA, mm -hmm. okay? It's not a great, it's a um, kind of a newer test. So just to give you an example, for HIV to make babies of itself, it needs your T cell. So it needs your T cell to be the womb okay. to become the viral birth control, I mean the viral birthing mechanism to make lots of new HIV particles. So how does it do that? 
it, it's, its genetic makeup is made of something called RNA. Mm -hmm. Our cells are DNA, okay? Mm -hmm. To make RNA, which is single strand in the DNA, that's where it uses reverse transcriptase. So that's why we have reverse transcriptase inhibitors, okay? okay. So what it does is it turns RNA into DNA mm -hmm. through reverse transcriptase, and then it incorporates or integrates that um, D new strand of DNA into our T cells mm -hmm. that is a genetic instruction blueprint to make HIV virus, okay? Right. <clears throat> so that's called integration. So that's why we, Devato is an integrase inhibitor, so mm -hmm. it stops that integration, and the reverse transcriptase stops that